Sam Smith and Mike Adams of the Trent Valley Ward here in Stoke Bardolph outside this fantastic, beautiful Stoke Bardolph Village Hall. The problem is it's been shut since 2016. We're sick of that. This community needs a heart and somewhere to go. So we're going to engage Seven Trent, who own the land. We're going to we've been engaged with the trustee and with the local MP and we're going to work together to try and get it open. Yeah, and this, this facility is an incredible local facility. It's, it can have so many amazing events on it. There's a, there's a huge area of green space at the back which could be used for uh, village fairs. Mm. Uh, inside there's a licensed bar as well, so I mean, reading receptions could be held here. Uh, there's also a, a phenomenal space with uh, and some incredible uh, structures inside which could be used for um, a museum to talk about Stoke Bottles. Uh, fantastic history uh, and I suppose you know the most important thing is, is it's here for the residents of Stoke Bardolph and so Kathy why is it important to you? Well we haven't got any community hub at all here and uh, nowhere to meet and for four years we've had nowhere to go for any social events um, to invite people to come and join us for social events and we just need somewhere we haven't even the church hasn't even got a hall so we're just desperate for just somewhere to meet. Yeah, yeah. and that's so what, what council I was going to say, it's an amazing space, isn't it? We yeah. can have a dance, we can have, we can have a wedding reception, we can have all those things which have been denied us for the last four years. Yeah, and Councillor Smith and I have already given £815, to be specific, towards the uh, Stoke Bardell Fund to, uh, to ensure this uh, space gets moving and work can begin. So we're working together with all those agencies involved and we're going to get it back open for this village. Thank you very much.